New tonight, three days after he was reported missing, family confirms Lewis Nix has been found dead in his car, pulled from a pond on Jacksonville's north side. Thanks for joining us on First Coast News at 11. I'm Jeff Vallon. Nix, just 29 years old, was a Jacksonville native, went from Reigns High to Notre Dame to a career in the NFL. Nix's car was pulled from a pond on Broxton Bay Drive near the northern I-95, I-295 interchange in Duval County. Brianna Ray Turner is live at the scene with the latest. Brianna, what are police saying tonight? Yeah, I'm on Bronxton Bay Drive, as you mentioned, and earlier today there was a heavy police presence with uh, JSO and right here at this retention pond right behind me. Now a car was pulled out of here later this evening. That's when JSO notified us that Nix was found, not saying any details of what condition he was in, just saying he was located. When JSO was on the scene, I did ask about new information. They said they're still investigating. I was able to get in touch with his former coach, Darren Wiley, who says he's not sure how this incident may have happened. He's a guy who fought really hard to, uh, to improve as a person, uh, overcoming a lot of obstacles. Wiley says that he's still shooken up about the whole thing and he's sending his prayers out to Nick's. Live in Jacksonville, Brianna Ray Turner, First Coast News on your side. Tragedy, thank you very much, Brianna.